And this is why I don't get to my hunting spots before daylight, because you'd damn near kill yourself trying to get out here. <laughs> Hello everybody and welcome. Today is my first bow hunt of the 2019-2020 season. Uh, it's about 38 degrees and normally I get to the woods before daylight, but this morning there was a wreck on the interstate and it took me about an hour and a half to get through all that. So due to the lateness of it, like I said, as you can see, the sun's already up and I think that I'm going to try to focus on finding food sources this morning. I really don't have high hopes for today because I'm running so late. So anyway, let's head out in the woods and see what we can do. I'm set up on a hardwood bottom this morning and walking in, there are acorns everywhere and from my vantage point, I can see a trail that runs along the creek bottom. And with the sun coming up over this valley, it looks like this trail is running north and south. I've actually got the wind with me this morning because it's blowing in my face. So I'm gonna sit here for a while and see if I can see anything. I said, here's the acorns that are in this area. And I said, I can hear them falling off the trees. So I'm gonna definitely mark this spot on my map. I found a tree that looks like a scrape, but I can't be entirely sure about it. If it is, it doesn't like it's been used much. And this is in the area that I'm currently set up for my bow hunt that I'm fixing to call a day. I want to move to another spot. And this is why I don't get out to my hunting spot before daylight, because as you can see, the train is quite treacherous. And if something happened to you, they'd never find you out here. And once you drop down into this valley, you have to follow it all the way to the end because there's no way you're gonna get back out.
I met my second post pipe and it's a deep wide creek bottom. And right out through here, there's actually a deer trail that runs down through here that I can see. So we'll sit up here for a little while, see how things go. I don't know if the camera's picking it up or not, but there's a little sapling right here and the bark is completely gone off one side of it and it looks like it's fresh. Here is some fresh deer scat that I found coming up from my second hunting spot. And like I said, it is fresh and it's kind of weird that it's on a leaf like the deer was trying not to dirty up the forest or something. So there is some sign that there's deer in the area. All right. I did not get a deer today, but I don't consider the day to be a total loss because I was able to find food, which would be the acorns. Uh, I found a water source, which would be the dried up creek had some deep pockets of water in it. And I found bedding, which would be the pine thickets along the high side of that valley that I was hunting. And I also found sign, both scat and rubs. So I feel like I'm going the right way this year and they've done a controlled burn and I'm guessing that they did it after hunting season last year because I know during last year's hunting season, it wasn't like this. So I feel like I'm on the right path this year. Thank y'all for watching. We'll see y'all next time.